Hey, that's not bad. Hey, we're back. We're back. Yes. <laughs> electrifying duo in sports entertainment is back. And fun fact of the day before we get started, did you know that when you snap your fingers, the sound is not from your fingers, it's your other finger hitting your palm. Wow, snap your fingers and step. Oh my goodness, it it's your palm. So we have the first Friday Night Lights internal announcement. I guess we do an internal Friday Night Lights at the end of every quarter. And this workout is exciting, Mr. Prince. I think it might involve some things. Hold on. Does oh, it? What is it? Does it involve these? No. No, not at all. Would he run push up? No. no. Okay. How about? This is not even make sense. I do an ab mat to a yoga block. Nope. Nope. That's not it. Okay. <laughs> N S F W. <laughs> I'll tell you what the workout does involve. A barbell. Oh. And it is. Five rounds. Oh, okay. Four time. I love four time. Lots. It's a hero. Okay, I know where this is going. Two letters. D. Yes. T. I love this one. Five rounds for times. Awesome. Twelve deadlifts. Nine hang power cleans. Six shoulder to overhead, 155 for the guys, 105 for the women, 105 for the ladies. It's going to be a good one. You guys better be ready to get after it. Friday Night Lights is kicking off again. You thought we were gone. We're back. We're never left. Never, never left. left. Let's go get it. All right. Ooh, workout tips. What a beautiful car. Stuck in it. So, for this workout, if you want to maximize your chances of success, if you're planning on holding on for big sets, you still want to reset your grip after the deadlift. So if you're hanging on for the deadlifts, I would drop at 11, I would re-grip, pick it up, you can go into your hang power cleans. No matter what you do, you're going to want to go from your last hang power clean directly into your shoulder to overhead. So if you need to break it up, plan accordingly. Burn. I love that. Um, I think we see comparators all the time. Uh, if you're going under six minutes, not letting go of the bar, but save your forearms. I love the 10, the 11, I apologize, 11 deadlifts, and then going to that hand clock power clean, and going into eight cleans, dropping, one clean, then five shoulder overhead. Absolutely. Even if you break up more than that, guys, remember, you want to leave that last rep of each movement in the tank before you get to the overhead. So leave your last deadlift in the tank if you have to pick it up anyways. Leave, leave your last hang power clean in the tank before you go into those jerks, and uh, hang on for dear life. What's up, you got?